Duck Life 4. Well, 5 for an extra congregate point. It's currently 6. Six forty eight PM The Yellow It's going to make it all the way this time. What, I already got $60? Oh, this includes your $60 starting cash. Okay, okay. They're always rocks. Oh, basketball this time. Oh, great. I got hit because I tried to... Let's keep going. Let's do this. You can push obstacles aside as soon as they hit bounce on the ground.
Yay, I got a five point congregate badge. And because it was the badge of the day, I got an extra five bonus points. One more. They bait you with money during the mini games. So, really, how long are you going to last if you try to collect as much money as possible? Officer, I think we got a riot on our hands. I like to say that each mini game is even more effective than the last. Let's see if we got what it takes. I'm slightly faster than the competition. Why do I go out of my way to collect the coins? There's no new badge. There's no badge after the easy one with about raising money. The next easy the next one is a medium one and it's for completing the mountain tournament. And the one after that, the third one, and it's the last one, is for being the entire game. Oh, I gotta up my leverage. Gotta run faster. Oh no! Get hit with misfortune like that, and you're pretty much guaranteed to fail. Especially in the later stages of that first mini game. You know, after it gets pretty fast. You don't even need to press a button.
my win, I should win by a larger margin now. We better up it up even more for that new race. There was no way we were going to survive that. We got money without even having to move. Officer, I think we have a ride on our hands. And I think it's being caused by how much money we're taking from the civilians. They like their money, see? But I say we just dodge everything they throw at us. And I mean everything. Even though it's a lot now. I'd say every point makes the ride up approximately a hundred times worse. Though it doesn't really seem like that drastic. Although, it's pretty drastic. Five does nothing. And so does six, seven, eight, nine, and zero. Uh -huh. First requirement race that not everyone can run. Luckily, I got plenty of energy for it. Nice, nice. One more running training. Well, well, I'm very fast, it just so happens. <laughs> if we were in the later stages of this mini game, we would have easily lost. You know, earlier back there, the later stages come after 7,000 points. Which you'll likely get to see. Guess not. 
Oh, great. The riders got us right off the bat. We slid too early. Only three extra running left. Not so good. Luckily, we're not fat. We can fit through very narrow spaces, which allows us to get to 3,000 points in a matter of seconds and almost every single time we play this minigame. Now, 5,000 is a little tougher, but just a little. Now, it requires a bit of luck to get to 7,000, and for good reason. You might get on the tiles bay. At this time, the riders don't get us right off the bat. So we really do manage to make it a good training day. You have to be a full-blown gambler in order to go under a danger square covered by a money square. At some point, at a certain special point, the riot becomes so bad that it becomes risky to even stand under a lone money triangle. And that point is at 10,000 points. Well trained. Well trained. You won't crash into anything real soon, my friend. All three of them. That's probably the uh, dumb thing to do, since they'll get tired and go slower. Hey, that was a quick race. But this one won't. Oh, that one was easy too. And now for the kicker. The shop is simply a place to buy hats. You can at least swim.
Barely made that one. The speed gets... The farther you go in this, the faster it gets. No, this is such an easy mini game. Once you've mastered the ropes, 10,000 shouldn't be a very hard goal. Though by 15,000, the speeds become so dizzifying that you can't believe how fast it is. Now let's see if we can reach 15,000. Now it becomes, the speed becomes progressively higher the further you go. So the speed will eventually become dizzifying. <laughs> now here's the turning point. The speed becomes quite high. Fifteen thousand. Good. Level 20. I've done swimming. Gee, I clearly haven't learned properly yet. I'll show them. I'm going to get a huge score on this. And then I'll be get so good at swimming that it'll be impossible to catch up to me. Although I really hope that's the last of all the competition trainings. Because, well, let's just say it can get pretty hard. It'll be pretty hard if I have to maintain multiple training for lounges. You know, categories. Multiple training categories. Expects to train. If I can reach 20,000, I'll be trained real good. Super good, as a matter of fact. But by that time, you have to be a psychic in order to make, continue maintaining your current speed. The speed gets so fast that by... 20,000, you have to practically be psychic. Oof. 
If you can make it to 50,000, then you probably are psychic. But that's definitely not going to happen. Because by... Man, there should be a hard metal for reaching 50,000 points on this. Because re the reaction training becomes insanely fast. It's like Flappy Bird. You just hit the space bar to go up. Although, except instead in Flappy Bird, you use your mouse. The turns getting it. Be the course becomes more aggressive the longer you go. Oh, that's pretty impressive. You can make a long dive. Okay, I should definitely be okay. I know the fastest of the three ducks. Now, what's the prize? I'm going to beat the swimmer. But first I have the uh, earlier... The, but first I have to take down his... Um, bodyguard. The swimmer's bodyguard. Yep, we're going to do it. Though it won't be a YouTube first, because... This game probably this game has this game probably has over a million plays. This is Duck Lake 4. Do you know how many game franchises have made it to 4? Not many. And I just managed to slide off a log. You can do the same to alligators, but not Okay. Okay. Pretty amazing I can still play and talk at the same time at this speed. But at 20,000, you really need to focus. Bad luck, Brian. Oh, I'm not even going to get a thousand on this. What? I only went up 10 swimming levels. Oh. Three swimming levels. Okay, so this guy is the swimmer. And this is the swimmer's bodyguard. I'll get him.
pretty fast swimmer, I like to say. And then obviously I'm gonna have to win the to tournament. It's gonna be a long and hard journey to beat this swimmer, believe me. But it'll be well worth it. At first the speed is so slow that you can sometimes wind up jumping on one of the crocodiles in the logs. But believe me, as it gets faster, you become less and less likely to do that. And you become less and less likely to get any coins. It becomes impossible to do that, you know, slide on a log or an alligator at about 15,000 points. Only if you're very lucky can you manage to do it at this speed. Apparently, these, apparently speed in this game is measured in swim boards. Huh, it Impressive 17,000 swim boards. Too bad that's not fast enough to win the tournament. <gasps> I've gone up at least 10 swim levels. But is that enough to win the tournament? Doubt it. Fourteen swimming levels. And for the tournament, believe me, we're going to need lots of food. This is my champion duck. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to successfully win the tournament that easily this time. Now this is the turning point. I have to beat the swimmer. All right, swimming the swimmer. We're going to swim the swimmer. And believe me, we'll succeed. I'd say we'll challenge him once we reach a very, very high level. Believe me, when you <laughs> get in your swimming frenzy, it gets real impressive how fast you can swim. Ain't that right? Yeah, I got that right. At level 100, I would say.
you have any idea how much a perfect could improve it? Quite a bit. 17 swim levels. I get almost no... I get practically all of my coins in this... In this... I get practically all of my coins on this mini game alone. You have to be lucky to get the coins, and increasingly more so as the speed increases. Sometimes you have to risk dying in order to get a coin. And other attempts to get coins are suicidal, such as that one. So I'm a bit too upward. One final training. Perfect. Now I'm ready. Greatest? More, more like worst. And he is more impressed. Oh, no, no, no. I believe I can fly, I believe I can touch the sky, I believe I can fly, I believe I can touch Oh man! Oh! That will that'll definitely result in this. That's not even good enough. You know how much time the swimming took?
five flying apples. That was a abysmal. That was an abysmal for part one before me. You'll be lucky to hit the last one. I got level 20 at least. I'm gonna have to become very good at flying if I want to be any good. At least level 40. I believe I can fly. Okay, good. Only 45 minutes so far. But believe me, if we hit an hour, this will be, it will take an insanely long time to upload. Hi, at this point, I actually, and if we hit 70 minutes, we might. Listen, I'm going to keep going till I win the mountains tournament. That's right. If we hit an hour, then it's going to take several hours to upload. And if we hit 90 minutes, it'll take so long to upload, I might actually have to say what current day it is. Just so you know the exact day I mi did this game on. There must have been a tiny rock. Now that was beyond pathetic. Since the limit is 40, level 40, we should probably enter when we're level 50. Though, believe me, 
you, do, you don't want to know how long that might take, although you're about to find out as I'm going to do that. So I can win the mountains tournament. If I do good on these other two mini games, I might actually be level 40. The farther for the reaction, the farther you get, the faster it gets. Ten whole flying levels. And now we're starting to go somewhere. At least in our flying mission. Believe me, training a new skill is not easy. You know, if we get high enough, they say that we'll never come down due to there not being gravity at all. But at what height is that? Is that number mean? Does that that number probably doesn't mean how many, how high we are in the sky in miles? I me I meant meters, meters. Or if it is, then it's probably more like inches, inches. That would be accurate. So how many inches would you have to fly into space just to make it? Ironically, I'll, during the gameplay, I'll waste time by checking how, how long the gameplay is currently. I've already done that several times, and that's how I knew 45 minutes at that time. There are little adjustments, and then big adjustments. The extra levels will make it even easier. What? It's almost as if... They're starting to be ducks faster. You know, you might have noticed that the ducks are able to run faster than me. Plus, with the time I just wasted by that failed attempt, that means I really got to get my act together. I've got to try even harder. And then after improving my flying speed, I'll go over and improve the other skills, such as running.
This, this one probably gives you the most. You have to go to the grassland to get better at running. With all the, with all the training between, well, after I won the grassland tournament and now, <laughs> I gotta be well rounded. So, to make it official that I managed to win this, Get off all the platforms as soon as possible. If I'm unlucky enough to get have to run such as that it should only take one training session to make me speedy again. You just slide under them to get past them faster with one. Jump and slide. Seven running levels. I should be ready now. Almost there. Six line levels and train your best, and you'll be the best. Train your worst, and you'll be the worst. The decision is yours, my friend.
run off the platform as soon as possible. That's the best strategy. Believe me, I know. In the later stages, this is definitely a good thing. Oh no, not the riot again. Although they, the rioters do occasionally accidentally throw a gold coin. But maybe they're just doing it to try to lure you into a, a falling object they drop down on you. Which happens pretty often. Four more running levels. And we are at a whopping 58 minutes. Let's see, let's... We're at over an hour at this point, which I gotta say is always that always means a nightmare upload. Well, not nightmare. It's just that it'll take a really long time to upload. And we're not even really that close to being done. For this, I shall call the special part for this gameplay shall be the ga part name for this gameplay shall be To the Mountains. Because we're going to the mountains. Nine flying levels. E, um. To ensure that we win the tournament and don't wind up wasting our time, 
we should make sure that we are well trained. We got lucky that time with that last one. Six flying left. And then we go back to the grasslands. A single duck can achieve success in the tournament. I only need one. It's currently March 14th, 2014. It is a Friday. Friday, March 14, 2014. It's currently 7.52 a.m. And this isn't done yet. I told you, we are going to make it all the way to the mountains. Not a full gameplay. That would be an absolute, absolute nightmare if we tried to upload a full gameplay of this game. We have to beat the champion, though. That is one feat I'm not going to attempt, even though the badge you earn if you succeed in that feat is a medium. Now let's aim for the tournament. There's the tournament. I think this is the point where you want to start to start being concerned about your energy. Believe me, we can't afford to lose performance in this tournament. I'm pretty sure that only happens if you run out of energy in a race. Oh, quite a bit of competition. I'm just barely faster than the competition. If I lose any performance, I'm done.
My superior swimming skill allows me to make it beat the second one, too. Now this one's the turning point. Am I destined for greatness? It appears I am. And I just got a 15 point congregate badge. Now what's this new skill? Climbing. Well, it's currently 7.56 p.m. 7.56 p.m. 